Hello, in this tutorial, we'll only be focusing on how to fix input claims errors for purchases and expenses form, an important step in VET return filing using our Taxpayer Online Portal, also known as TPORS. In the first line, total VET on purchases and expenses for which tax invoicing requirements have been met. Click the form icon. Once loaded, you will have two options to filling the form. The first is by inputting your data directly to their appropriate fields. The second is by using the download and import option. In this tutorial, I'll run you through both options. Let's start by directly inputting data on the form. The invoice date field, the supplier tin field, the supplier's name field will be populated automatically thereafter. The supplier invoice number field. Note that the system will not accept a duplicated supplier invoice number. Invoice total field. VAT incurred field, note that you can only claim 9% or less than 9% of VAT in this field. And lastly, capital or revenue field. In the drop down you select the one applicable to you. You can click on the add new button to add more lines to the form. Once completed, click the confirm button and this will update the values on the main purchases and expenses form. Great, now let's try the second method by using the download template and import option. Similar steps in the previous method will apply for the download template and import file option. Important notes to check when using the download template option. 1. Date format must be correct. 2. Suppliers tin must not have a dash. 3. All invoice numbers are complete with the correct digits. Similar to the previous input method, the system will not accept a duplicated supplier invoice number. 4. The values should not have the dollar sign of formulas in their fields. 5. The capital revenue expenditure column is represented by a number. Should if any of these errors exist, the system will not respond when you click confirm. The best way to avoid these errors is by copying your data from your accounting system and pasting it as values in the FRCS Excel template. Save your template Excel and click on Import File to upload it on TPORS. The system should accept your Excel and update your data on the main purchase and expenses form. Similar steps in this tutorial will also apply to the Input Adjustment form. This completes our tutorial on input claims errors. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more tutorial videos.